Hi, hello, how are you all? Welcome back to my class. Today in this class, we are going to continue our same lesson of maths that is five digit numbers. So, open page number one. So, here it is a page number one, unit one, five digit numbers. So, already we have started this lesson, isn't it? And we have solved the revision part, then we have already solved this exercise uh, 1.1. In that, we have solved first, second, third main. Fourth, fifth, sixth, and seventh men, right? If you have not seen those classes videos, you will get the links in my description box. So just check it out. Okay. So today in class we are going to continue with the eighth men. Okay. So let's start. Write the following numbers in increasing order. That is ascending order. Increasing means what? From small to big. Okay. Increasing. Okay, it will start from small to big. So, that we call it as increasing order. That is nothing but the ascending order. You have to remember this. Okay, ascending order means from small to big. Here I will write small to big. It will become easy for you. So, ascending means small to big. Okay. So, here they have given the numbers. Those are five digit numbers are there. You have to arrange these numbers from small to big. Okay. So, first if you read here. 30,435, 70,533, 20,411, 40,623. Right. So, among all these four numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4. So, which is the smallest number you have to find. So, here 30,000, huh. how you have to find out, you have to always start looking the number from which is in the highest place. So, unit, if you take this number, unit 10, 100,000, 10,000, right? So, you have to see the number which is in the highest place. So, if you see that is in the 10,000 place. So, here it is a 3, right? And it is 7, here 2, here 4. So, which is the uh, smallest number here 2 means so this is the 20,411 is the first smallest number ok so here I will write the same example so here, here you can see I have written it already so 20,411 so this is our first number right so I will write here 20,411 ok next after this which is the smallest number so this is we have done this one right Yes. So, after this one, which is the smallest number? 30,435, 70,533, 40,623. Again, you have to see the number which is in the highest place. That is 10,000 place. Here it is 3, here it is 7 and it is 4. So, which is the smallest? Yes, 3 is the smallest. So, means that this is the next smallest number after 20,411. So, I will write here 30,435. Okay. Yes. Now, put the comma. I mean, we will go to the next one. Yes, we have done this one. Now, we are having two numbers. 40,623 and 70,533. Which is the highest here? You have to see this number. That is 10,000 plus 7 and 4. Which is the smallest after this number? So, 4 is, right? So, 4,000. I mean, 4. So, 40,623. So, of course, the last one is this one. Which is remained here. That is 70,533. So, this we called as the ascending order or the increasing order. It will start from small to small to big. You just remember this. Okay. Next, we'll take one more example. You can see we are having this one, second one. So, this same thing I have written here. So, here I have written that one already. Just you read these numbers 44,444, 44,044, 40,444, 40,044. So, you have to go from small to big. So, which is the smallest number here? So, first we have to see the number which is in the highest place. That is in the 10,000 place. So, here it is 4. Here it is 4. Here it is 4. Here it is 4. So, in this case, see all our 4 are there. So, we are not able to see which is the smallest or which is the highest number, right? So, next you have to go to the next highest number. After 10,000, which is the next highest number? So, here I will write. So, here. Then this is 10,000, right? So, after after 10,000, which is the highest uh, number? I mean, place. So, 1,000, right? So, you need 10, 100,000, 10,000. So, 1,000. Now, you have to go to the 1,000 place. Yes, so here, 4, 4, 0, 0. Means, here 0, 0. So, these are smallest. Yes, so, it, 0 is the 0. So, in these two, 1 is the smallest number, right? So, we are having two numbers. Now, 
observe the number which is in the highest place after that next highest place that is thousand after thousand which is the highest place hundred right so now you have to go to the hundred place when you have to go to the next highest place when the numbers are same in the same place here in ten thousand place four four in thousand place zero zero we are not having any op options then we have to go to the next highest here so that is hundred so here four in the hundred place four and here under in the hundred place zero so which is smallest here then zero is the smallest so this is the smallest number so we'll write here forty thousand forty four so this is the smallest number right after this one now we are having three numbers now 44444 44444 40444 again you have to do the same thing 444 four, four. okay next 440 four, yes so zero means this is the smallest number next so that is 40444 then Next, we are having two numbers. Now, you have to see which is the smallest number among these two. So, 44,444, 44,044. So, if you see here, here uh, the number in the highest place, 4, 4 are same. Okay. 4, 4 are same. Next, again, 4, 4 are same. Next, the number which is in the next, after this, which is the highest place, 100. So, in the 100, 4, here it is the zero so which is smaller zero or four zero so this is the next smallest number so we have to write here 44,044 next of course the remaining one that is a 44,444 that is the last one 44,444 so this is your answer this is how you have to solve okay now let's move to the next one so, here the first one we have done, the second one we have done, now we will go to the third one. So, already I have written that same example here, you can see, right. So, let's do it. 63,841, 63,481, 63,148, 63,184. So, how we have to uh, see that, which number is smallest? Yes, we have to start from the highest place. Here it is 6, highest place means which place? 10,000. So, unit 10, 100, 1000, 10,000. So, 6, 6, 6, 6. All are 6. So, we are not able to, which is the smallest one. Now, we have to go to the next highest. After the 10,000, which is the next highest? That is 1000, right? So, we will see. 3, 3, 3, 3. Again, 3, 3 are in the 1000 uh, place. And after the 1000, which is the highest place? That is a 100, right? So, here. 8, 4, 1, 1. So, 8 is bigger, 4 is bigger, 1, 1. We are having 1, 1 here, right? So, next, after this one, we are not able to see which is the smallest here then. Then, we have to go to the next highest place after 100, which is the next highest place. After 100, 10, right? So, now you have to go to the 10 place. So, here it is a 4, here it is a 8. So, which is the smallest 10? 4 or 8? 4. So, this is the first number. So, this is our first number. I will write here 63,000. 148 is our first number that is the smallest number okay now after this one next you have to see again the same method you have to apply 63,844 63,481 63,184 which is smallest 666 six, six. then 333 three. next 841 right yes so here 8 is bigger 4 is also bigger so 1 is the smallest so this is our second smallest number that is 63,184 right yes now after this one we are having two numbers right so 66338 six, three, and 4 which is smallest 8 or 4 4 so this is our third smallest number 63,481 okay yes now, let's move to the last one. That is, of course, the remaining one with the last smallest number. So, we'll write here 63,841. Okay. So, this is how we have to solve. Are you getting? Yes. Very good. Now, we'll go to the fourth one. Here it is there. The fourth one. Okay. So, already have written it here. You can see 50,060, 50, 50,500, 55,000, 50,006. So, how we have to see? You, are, you only have to tell me now. You have to start from the highest. Yes, so 5, 5, 5, 5. Then 0, 0, 5, 0. Yes, so 5, of course, it is bigger. We are having 3 number now. 0, 0, 0. Among these, we are not able to understand, right? Next, you have to go to the next highest place. That is 0, 5, 
zero. So again, five is bigger. So just leave this one now. We are having zero and zero, right? Next, then also we are not able to see. I mean, recognize. Now, next highest place that is ten. So six and zero. Yeah. So here the zero is the smallest. So this is our first smallest number that is fifty thousand six is our first high smallest number. After this one, we are having three more numbers, right? So among these one, which is the smallest now? You tell me fast. Here five, five, five. Then zero, zero, five. So of course five is bigger. Just leave this one. Now we are having two numbers. So zero, zero. Then after here zero, here is a five. Which is the smallest? Five or zero? Zero. So this is our second smallest. So that is fifty thousand sixty is our next smallest number. After this one, we are having two more numbers. So it is fifty thousand five, five. Then five, zero, five. Which is the smallest? Zero or five? Zero. So this is our third smallest number. So right here fifty thousand five hundred. The last one that is a fifth. The remaining one that is a next and the last smallest number. So fifty five thousand. If you observe, okay. Later I will tell you. Now we'll uh, do one more example. That is our last example in this main. The fifth one here you can see right. So I already have written the same example here. Twenty thousand three hundred twenty five. Twenty thousand eight hundred twenty five. Twenty thousand three. Hundred two twenty thousand four hundred thirteen. So children, you just try to do this one, okay? What you can do is just pause the video here only and try to solve. Okay, once you solve it, then you start the video and you will get the answer. You just cross check your answers with my answer, okay? Let's do it. So children, have you solved it? I hope so. So here are the answer. You can just go through it, okay? Yes. I hope you all have done it correctly, right? Yes, well done, champs. So, children, in today's class, we have done only the eight men because it's become too much lengthy for you also. So, in the next video, I'm going to continue with the next men. Okay. So, till then, take care of yourself. Be with me and try to solve more of the examples by yourself. So, you'll become perfect in that. Okay. And how do you feel about my videos? Let me know in the comment section. And once again, I will remind you that you will get the previous videos links in my description box. So just go through it, okay? And if you think this video is really useful to you, know what you have to do? Yes, you have to like, share with your friends, do subscribe my channel. Till then, bye bye.